When I started making films, I literally Googled cool looking cameras and I would try to find like the biggest rig and the thing that looked most pro. That was my focus when I started. But when I got into telling stories and um, trying to be honest to my perspective, I realized that this isn't about the camera. The more you can minimize the production aspect of the production, the more you can get authenticity. I think that any tool that allows you to do that is enabling more powerful and intimate storytelling. It's the best job in the world. Who else can say they go to work just to play and have a good time? So, like for instance, when we had the color checker and we could run into an environment and know our colors were accurate and then be unbound by that technical responsibility, we were able to be completely in the moment. There's sort of like the ethical approach to uh, doing a documentary, right? Like you want to be honest to the subject and the world that we're trying to portray. This is a this is a portrait. All right, let's go for some chips. Using the color checker to get a sense for you know the scene and to match our cameras and find a good place to set our balance and exposure for early on uh, with each scene really enabled us to just go. All of us in some way or another had a personal interaction with the people around us, had a personal connection to the story we were telling. And so I want people to feel what it was like for us to be there. Oh my god, dude! <laughs> oh. That's where I'm at so far. Oh, that feels so good. Let's bring this together. I'm gonna intercut it with the elders leaving and then fade out when it comes back to Mark. And he's like, good mm. job, and then fade out. So right now we uh, we had worked in two multiple different formats, and uh, we were trying to match a look that we made for our A cam to footage that was shot in a different color space in a different camera. Pretty good. With this piece, our intention was to create a look that was based in what we saw, not necessarily how the camera captured it, but what we saw when we were there, what the space felt like to us. But to have the color checker know exactly where the light was shifting, like what colors were being affected, and we can take that information and then build a look. I mean, we can leave a lot of it in, but at least we'll know like where the color was and like where we can go with it. Veneer still looks good. Our focus was using tools to get us to an honest place. Inspiring people here. If we could get that feeling, like, then we, we did it.